Hey everybody, this is episode 2 of Tools of the Trail. We're going to check out my storage this time, or at least half of it. We'll have to do a part 2 for the other half. In the rear of my Gladiator, I keep about half of my storage. Containers I use are nothing special, just a Walmart brand heart. I typically keep these in here, just in case I need them. But I will most of the time take out my overlanding box. I only keep these strapped in with just some bungee straps when I'm not actually out on the trail. Just because it's easier and quicker to get it in and out. So, let's take a look inside. Inside the top of this box, I keep bug spray. Because we all know you need bug spray out on the trail. I keep these super suction cups. These are actually for my tarp in case we needed additional coverage. And then I keep my gloves that are good for being able to handle hot things such as my cast iron or Dutch oven. What you'll notice is that these are two separate pieces. And because of that, they're snackable, which is why I went with these. Inside here, I have some Velcro tape, uh, just some miscellaneous tools such as uh, a multi-tool and a knife in case it's needed. Keep my Midland additional pieces in there, some TP because we all need TP. Uh, I also have a propane contain, uh, canister in here, a medium tarp, which has not been opened yet because we haven't needed it, and the, this box should only come with one of these. I actually took the other one out of my other box and I put it in here because that box needed some additional overhead space. So this is my overland box. Now, the other box over here, this box contains uh, my tools, recovery gear type stuff, um, and just some uh, other miscellaneous things. So we have Snatch Block, Gear America, um, we have some synthetic rope snatch blocks. Uh, these were on the Gladiator before. They're Rhino USA green shackles. Uh, they're just spares for now. And of course, zip ties. Because you can't go wrong with the zip ties. Inside of this box is a grease gun. Just in case. Never know when I'm going to need one. Um, it's also a good place for me to keep it, so I don't have it getting grease all over everything. I have one of my two uh, synthetic um, soft shackles. And then inside of here is also where I carry my Rhino USA 4-3-inch uh, strap, 4-inch strap, something like that. Uh, I want to say it's a 4-inch strap. Um, 30 foot and just never know when I'm gonna need it. I do however have a kinetic rope that one stays in the cab under the back seat at all times that these do stack so I can actually take this one place it on top of that one and latch it in place which makes them one giant piece which is why I went with these. I do have the cart one However, that does not fit in the bed of the Gladiator with the tunnel cover now. Alright, so that's it for Tools of the Trail. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, on the next episode, we'll check out the storage on the inside. Uh, check out some of my other videos, you know, like this one, this one. Give me a subscribe. Just trying to get to 100 before the end of the year. So I definitely appreciate it. Thanks for watching.